Controlling difficult customers. Mastering call center role play customer service skills. Call center agent and customer. Thank you for calling Express Delivery Services. My name is Sandra. How can I assist you today? I am so angry. Honestly, I've had it with you people. This delivery service is a joke. My package is late, and I don't want to hear any more excuses. I need it now, not tomorrow, not next week. Seriously, I've had it up to here trying to get through to you guys. I'm really sorry to hear that, sir. I completely understand how upsetting it is when something important doesn't arrive on time. Let me gather some more details about what's going on with your order so I can help resolve this as quickly as possible. Could you let me know your order number, please? Yeah, hold on a sec. Where the hell did I put that? All right, here it is. The number is 88356-13. But honestly, what difference does it make? You'll probably just tell me it's stuck somewhere, like every other time. I'm tired of this runaround with you people. I can imagine your frustration, sir. It must be exhausting to keep calling and not get the answers you need. Let's see if we can change that today. I'll take a look at your order right now and give you a clear update. Please hold on for just a moment. Thank you for your patience. It looks like the recent storms in your area have delayed your package at the shipping facility. I completely understand this isn't the news you wanted to hear, especially with how it's impacting your package. I do apologize for the inconvenience. Storms? Come on, Sandra. It's always something, isn't it? First, it's system issues then high volume, and now it's the weather. I'm so fed up with this. You guys should have a backup plan for things like this. I realize it can be quite frustrating when you've been told different things each time, and I completely understand how it feels like you're being left in the dark. What I can tell you is that the storms caused some widespread delays, but the good news is your package is now back on track and should arrive tomorrow. I can see that it left our shipping facility a few hours ago. Tomorrow? That's not exactly a solution, is it? I've got a customer waiting on me and this delay is making me look bad. How am I supposed to explain this to them? I completely understand how this delay is putting you in a difficult position with your customer, and I'm really sorry it's caused you so much stress. While I can't change the weather, what I can do is make sure your package gets the priority it needs now that it's back in transit. I'll also personally follow up with you tomorrow to make sure it's arrived on time, so you won't have to worry about chasing down updates. Well, I suppose that's better than nothing, but I'm still stuck explaining this mess to my customer. Not exactly looking forward to that conversation. I completely understand. I know it must be very challenging when you're the one facing your customer's frustration. But, on the bright side, at least you have a concrete update to share with them now and you can let them know it's arriving tomorrow. Plus, I'll be here to follow up and make sure everything's on track. It sounds like you've been handling this situation really well, given how much is out of your control. I guess that's true. I've been doing what I can, but it's still been a major headache. I can only imagine, sir. But your persistence shows you're dedicated to your customer, and that's something not everyone has. I'm confident that once the package arrives tomorrow, you'll be able to smooth things over. It's just one last hurdle, and I'll make sure you're supported all the way. Well, I appreciate you saying that. I've been pretty frustrated, but at least I know you're trying to help. You've been a lot nicer than the other agents I spoke to. I really appreciate you trusting me with this. You've been more than patient, and we're almost at the finish line. I'll keep an eye on your order and will personally reach out tomorrow to confirm it's been delivered. Does that sound all right? Yeah, that works for me. Let's hope this is the last time I have to deal with this. I truly hope so, too. Thank you again for your understanding. I'll be in touch tomorrow, and I hope your day starts looking up from here. All right. Thanks for your help. We'll see how it goes tomorrow. Thank you, sir. Take care, and I will touch base with you again tomorrow. I really hope I get that package tomorrow. I'm confident you will, sir. Goodbye. If you enjoyed this video, please click the like button and subscribe to Single Step English. And remember to watch our other role play videos.